Ho oh, Mario for 140 seconds vlog number 138 wedding hello hello welcome 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 well today I went to my son's wedding with uh, all of our children so we were, finally we we're all together all four children and Lindy and I my wife it was a wonderful day wonderful family occasion and the days around it and today have been uh, wonderful as well we have another day or two together all of us together so it's been really great really really happy it's we think it's around about four or five years since we've all been together again and um, yeah we all still get on with one another um, which is marvelous so it was a lovely wedding at um, uh, high up in the Rocky Mountains uh, with a great view out uh, over the surrounding land. Uh, the wedding it took place outdoors in the, in the foothills of the Rocky Mountains and then we went uh, down to um, now of, of pronunciations escaped me Chautauqua, Ch Chautauqua um, which was a um, lovely little venue uh, that dates back to uh, pre-1900s and is actually a movement. Um, so possibly a little bit more on that uh, later on, the Chautauqua movement. But they had a lovely hall here, which, um, yeah, was very, uh, very, very interesting. But um, I really, uh, the, the, the sort of, not the, the, I was so impressed with my young grandson, uh, Isaac, not yet one years old and uh, he took on the best man's duties uh, did an admirable job and um, to me he got the prize for the doing the most mingling at the wedding <laughs> every time we looked around Isaac was with a sitting on a different person's knee or interacting with them he was, had a wonderful day no grumpiness uh, such a such a great boy and uh, a fine um, a fine grandson to uh, carry on the uh, O'Neill tradition so yeah we had a wonderful time at the wedding um, a, a great family occasion and uh, yeah very very happy uh, very happy Morio uh, having uh, yeah had all the family around and we had such a wonderful time alrighty so today's background is this guy here now <laughs> I uh, I hope you, he, he's um, not his best pose possibly, but uh, you should be able to work out who he is and his uh, relationship um, to today's title shouldn't be too difficult. Uh, yesterday's title was um, the the answer was the flat hinds, and these are the hills that we uh, see or the the mountains that we see around. Um, boulder here and there's apparently they're shaped like flat irons which are irons you know that we use to iron our clothes and um, so they're sort of triangular shapes and uh, if you get a picture at the right angle and that it can be clearly seen the 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 triangular shapes or the flat irons there's five of them um, in this area one after the other and it's part of the rock foundations as ably described in the comments of yesterday's vlog by WT who did a been doing a great job um, pointing out the ins and outs of the the various topics so um, yeah cheers thanks for that and uh, yeah had a wonderful day and uh, well I've got a couple more days here in Boulder before we head back to Narawahia so uh, yeah Hope I can keep. Um, I'm going to keep on enjoying myself. Cheers. See you.